These digital collages I call painting with photographs. I use all my own photographs and combine any number of images. I select according to the statement I want to convey, picking images that resonate or create a dialogue of opposites. Sometimes they are images I shot in close proximity of time, reflecting what I am focusing on. Other collages might span images from different years and different places, cultures and countries in stark contrast that come together because of some commonality they share, begging to have a dialogue. This ongoing self-portrait series evolved from my fascination with reflections and the things we don't see rushing by. Living in Los Angeles, where image and icons are everything, I decided one day that my incessantly curly hair could be an icon. But in this city, women of a certain age basically become invisible. So it became a pertinent statement of our times to capture the shadow or reflection of my hair with no discernible other identifiers. They are reflections, sometimes capturing what is inside the windows inside of me, sometimes just blending me into the environment, a bit like Finding Nemo. They are straight photographs, not digital collages. They have been taken all over the place, around Europe, the East Coast, and the Western states, peering into the windows of many cultures and all sorts of enterprises. I started out as a painter, but made my living as a graphic designer. I look at the world with a painter's eye and for images as parts of paintings. And so, I develop ways to make painterly photographs. The mixed media pieces started in the early 90s when I was working on a series of double and triple exposure photographs done in the camera. I primarily shot glass and steel skyscrapers and illegal graffiti. These are examples of that time. When I first put the images in clean and tidy white mats, they didn't feel right, so I started painting on the mats, then started adding found elements. My work constantly shifts back and forth from reflections about the world around me to my personal reflections on my life journey. A few of these were my self-selected assignments on the Greek island of Idra, to gather things found on ancient stony pathways and turn them into assemblages. Most of these other larger pieces deal with issues I care about, like how we are damaging the planet, the oceans, our greed, our addiction to fossil fuels, child abuse, and how different cultures struggle to get along, respect, and understand each other.